I'm Howell Couch. I work here in St Fangs Museum as the Exploring Nature Facilitator. I started working here in 2005. I started front of house, so I worked in the old buildings, answering people's questions, looking after the houses. The museum opened in 1948. Um, at the time it opened, it was just the large manor house. And over the years, um, the staff here have been collecting buildings from around Wales, essentially. They've been um, taking down old buildings, bringing them here and rebuilding them. So we now have a collection of 40 plus buildings, all from different time periods, from all over Wales. My main job here as the Exploring Nature Facilitator is to try and um, emphasise and promote the nature living within the museum. Right, we've got lots of different bird feeders outside the bird hide um, to attract the birds so that when the public do come, they'll obviously get to see something happening. Um, in this one here, we've got lots of peanuts, which attract lots of different types of birds. We get lots of different tits coming here. We get great tits, blue tits and cold tits. But also because of the peanuts, we also get things like the great spotted woodpecker and the nuthatch, which are quite exciting to see. For lots of people, they're not going to go out of their way to visit nature, reserves or bird hides. So the fact that we've got the audience here already, we have over 600,000 visitors a year coming to the museum. So it gives an extra dimension. I'm quite lucky at the moment that lots of the work I'm doing is indoors um, because it is bitterly cold at the moment. Um, so I'm doing lots of work in the office. Uh, we've been um, using infrared technology to film bats which we have living on site. We've got some quite rare bats, um, less of horseshoes. Because the project is still new, we're still working on lots of the interpretation material that we're going to be using next year. So what we have here is a bird winder where you can select a different bird and then by turning the handle it gives out the bird call. It's very handy for learning the different calls of the birds in the woods. Today because we're approaching Christmas um, I've got a little weekend on called Sustainable Christmas. Um, part of what I do is also environmentally based so I do lots of workshops about the environment. What we're making here are some Christmas decorations which are made by threading some string through some cranberries and some popcorn. Um, you can put them on your Christmas tree or just dot it around your house and then after the festive season you can put them outside in the garden and it should attract some birds to come. My favourite thing about working in the museum here um, is probably the fact that I get to be outdoors. It's a lovely place, I mean the woodlands are fantastic so it's, it's just nice to have an opportunity to be able to go outdoors.